what essentially happens here is you get exactly into what Fanon characterizes the zone of being and the zone of non being. Those people whose humanity is recognized. Remember the story we always tell about if the cousin of the CEO dies, there will be an announcement sent to all employees. But the mother of a security guard who was at the entrance of MITCO, at the entrance of the University of Namibia, who was opening and waking up every time. When the mother dies, no one will know. There will be no announcement. Because the dignity, you, you are existing, Fanon talked about the line of the human. So in human relations, what capitalism, what colonialism have done is to draw a line of the human. Just like a red line, but in terms of human relations. Where you have the northern side of the red line and the southern side of the red line. Fanon says there are people whose humanity is not recognized. They are in the zone of non-being. And there are others who are in the zone of being. Their humanity is recognized. The CEO would be in the zone of being. To an extent that the cousin would be announced that uh, the CEO lost a cousin, please, uh, when you make an appointment, be considerate. But the security guard, when its mother dies, there will be no announcement. No one even would listen to why the security guard is late. So, I'm proceeding from that. That's where the revolutionary lawyer ended to say that at the core of what we are saying is dignity. And this is a classical case. In fact, every time I pass by Oshibelo, I stop. And the, 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 those veterinarian officers actually know me now. So the lady, whenever she says, ah, but go, 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 we don't, me, I'm saying, okay, you don't have to do this anymore. We are going to remove this thing. And you don't have to be searching cars and you can sit in the offices, analyzing samples of diseases and things like, instead of you being here, standing all the time for 24 hours. So we, we cannot lose faith. You cannot lose hope. Uh, because it's bigger than the meat, it's bigger than the members, it's bigger than the pigs. Human dignity. To affirm that human dignity mm. as a masses of our people. Because once we do that, you will see how, and I'm convinced that our society is going to transform uh, in most profound ways. Activist Matthias, you ask what happened after 2014. This report went to cabinet. I had actually got it from a permanent secretary, one of the, he's a retired man now. I was very angry that it went to cabinet and uh, but you must remember, in any relationship, power dynamics are always determined. Cabinet has probably, how many minutes do we have, 18 or 20? But I'm sure in the cabinet meetings, probably only five or six people speak. Uh, I, would, I, would, I would assume that, yeah, you know, some people would not probably make a contribution. So it went to cabinet and nothing ever happened. But they also know that we want.